How's it going, YouTube? Are you tired of missing Zerth's ultimate? Do you feel like you're missing out on free kills just because you can't land your R? Well, look no further. I'm a Grandmaster Zerth One Trick, and I'm here to teach you all the tips and tricks that I know about landing his ultimate. Let's get into it. So what does Xur's ultimate ability actually do? It is called the Rite of the Arcane. What it does is locks us down into place, letting us be a semi-global ultimate. It allows us to shoot between three to five shots, revealing vision per each shot. You can tell how many ultimates you have depending on what level you are. Level six, you get three. Level 11, you get four. And level 16, you get five. Now let's talk about the three different ways of how I use my Xur's ultimate ability. Number one, leading with your ultimate. All right, to give an example of leading with your R, take a look at this Lulu. We just killed her jungler and there's no one else around. She only has really one escape route. So what we're gonna do is actually throw our R pretty much in front of her, giving her one of two options. She can either A, dodge her ultimate, or B, run into her ultimate and take the blunt of the damage. To give another example with leading with R, look how I'm placed my ultimates. Look exactly right here. My R is not even on top of him. It's not even touching him, it's in front of them. And we're leading with the R. It gives him one of two options again, where it's either he's gonna get hit by our R ability or he has to run back into our teammate and die either way. Now use number two of Zerth Ultimate is definitely my hands down favorite. It's called the Fast Ultimate. Now I know a lot of you may be thinking, isn't that where you just spam your R ability? To put it simply, Yes, but we have a predetermined shot pattern that we're going to do that I find people have a natural dodge pattern. If you don't give them time to react, this is the best way you're going to hit a majority of the time. Okay, so the fast ultimate, what is it? So when you're shooting, my very first shot is going to be directly on top of them. This is because a lot of people actually don't see when you're pressing your R ability, so they actually don't even react to the first shot. So you want to make sure the first one is directly on top of them. The number two shot is going to be directly behind them. Look where the safety is. His uh, safety towards his tower is actually above him, but he actually dodges towards us. Why does he do this? Because he actually knows that we are targeting him. So a lot of people natural reaction is to dodge backwards into you because they think they're being clever but we're actually just outsmarting them and number three is actually directly in front of them now here's another example of the fast ultimate of course the first shot is always going to be on top of them now i noticed as a brand is moving towards this tower so i did shoot my shot uh in front of him but I normally do it behind him but it can go either way so if you notice that since i did do it in front of him on my second shot i threw it behind him on the third shot now the third way I use my ultimate is the simplest one. It's called pretty much the patient ultimate. And what you're doing is pretty much you're activating your ulti, you're shooting once, and you're just waiting for them to kind of outsmart themselves. You're just holding on to it as long as possible. One of the biggest tips I can give you guys for the Zerth ultimate is that Zerth ultimate Honestly, it's really hard if you're just trying to solo kill a person with your R, but if you're setting up your team for a pick, that's where it becomes so easy to land these Rs because you're giving them, like I said, one of two options, either run into your team or run into your ultimate. So it's really trying to save your ultimate for setting up picks. All right, I really hope these different ways and tips really help you with landing more of your Zarath ultimate. Don't get stressed out. Don't get frustrated. It comes over time. I've missed plenty of Zarath's ultimate along the way, and I still miss it. But I really hope this does help you increase your accuracy and look at using Zarath ultimate just a little differently. And guys, please like and subscribe to the video. I'm releasing weekly content on YouTube and streaming daily on Twitch. I do hope to see you guys there, and I do hope you enjoyed, and have a good one. Restlessness to hell and back. What's my oh, purpose? Or do I cry? I'm a slippery surface, a heart attack. Okay. And sometimes you just gotta oh. believe. There's something that will okay. give you relief. Okay. There's something that will have what you need. That's just what you need. We're broken, it's tragic. We're not all elastic, but maybe there's magic. Believe you could have it. I what? know of sadness, the anxious and panic, yeah, like the bitch. infinite vastness of all that is blackness. Oh, he didn't see that coming! Wow! If I can just... Can you, can you, thank you! Man, Brenda's... Oh! 
Oh, he, three bars, fucking huge. Oh my. Oh my God, who is this Zerith player? Oh my God, we didn't want that was sick. Dude, that was crazy. Do you like some help? What the fuck just happened? There's so much shit that just happened. And... Okay, the cleanup! We're too good. Oh my god.